Hey, ladies and gentlemen, what is going on, man? It is your boy, Matt Merced, and I'm here with yet another Red Dead Redemption 2 video for you guys today. Now, I'm, I'm here with a pretty special video. What I'm going to be showing you guys in this video here is how you're going to be able to get Jeremy Gill's Fisherman's Hat, as well as your special spinner lore in Red Dead Redemption 2. Now, there's a couple of steps that you need to uh, actually complete in order for you to actually... Um, access these items and have them available for yourself. So stay tuned, sit back and relax as I will break down in this video how you guys are going to be able to receive these items for your character in Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, thank you guys for staying tuned once again. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're new and hit that like button if this video helped you guys out. And without further ado, let's get right into this video. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the first things first... Uh, what you're going to want to do is actually catch every single legendary fish in Red Dead Redemption 2. But don't worry, man. If you click one of the links down below in the description, my legendary fishing guide, I will have 13 different videos showing you guys how you can catch every single legendary fish in Red Dead Redemption 2. There is a video in there how you can catch a secret legendary pike. You don't have to worry about that. You just have to catch the base 13 legendary fish in red dead redemption 2 now after you guys catch all these fish what you're going to want to do is mail every single one of the fish to the post office and after you guys mail everything to the post office after you mail your last fish uh you will receive a letter from jeremy gill the guy who gave you the actual fishing map in the beginning of the game and you're going to want to receive that map then you're going to want to open up your satchel and actually open up the invitation um once you guys open up the invitation uh, you're gonna receive a message from Jeremy Gill explaining uh, I didn't really I didn't really read what the invitation was but just know when you guys complete this and you actually get the invitation and you open it when you open up your map here you're gonna receive a prompt to go back to Jeremy Gill's cabin where you guys first received uh, the fishing maps so that's what you're gonna want to do when you guys pull up in this location after you caught all the legendary fish and you opened up the invitation you're gonna want to walk over to the side door walk up to it and you're going to knock on it and after you guys knock on it you're going to be invited into jeremy gill's house once you guys knock on the door you're going to be given a cutscene where john marston is going to be talking to jeremy gill keep in mind that you have to complete epilogue one for the Stephen beer reality for you guys so once you guys complete epilogue one you go into jeremy gill's cabin he's going to tell you about a secret channel catfish uh, legendary channel catfish that can be caught so then you're going to be given into another cutscene where you guys are going to go into rio bravo and you're actually going to go and try to hunt for this legendary uh channel catfish now once you guys finish all the cutscenes and you actually make it to the point of where the fish is located jeremy gill is going to ask you to take some pictures of him uh actually catching this fish now once you guys do that here you're going to be given the opportunity to have your camera open and you're going to take some pictures and then eventually it will fade into the nighttime and then he will finally reel this fish in and he will get taken into the water forever and jeremy gill will actually disappear um and he will no longer be a character i guess in red dead redemption 2 as far as i'm concerned um but after this cutscene ends here you're going to receive a trophy called collector's item and this is where you're going to receive your items you're going to walk over on the ground and you're going to pick up the special spinner and in the water, as you guys can see glowing up, if you walk into the water, you can hold square or uh, X on the Xbox and you guys can actually pick up this fisherman's hat and actually keep it for yourself. Now, one thing I want to do here before we end this video is address the legendary channel catfish. Um, in Red Dead Redemption 2, there's only 13 fish. This is supposedly number 14. Um, I fished for this thing for about an hour using a special river lure as well as a special spinner and I actually couldn't find nothing But the craziest thing about this fish is that when you guys open up your map, you're actually gonna see that uh, There's a picture for a legendary catfish on the map um, I fished for this thing for over an hour and couldn't find nothing So I decided to go on the internet and try to figure out what the hell's going on with this thing And it turns out that this fish is not even catchable or people say it's not catchable. Um, I fished out here for an hour. I couldn't find anything. Um, so yeah, if anything updates with this game and they actually make it so you can catch this fish, uh, you can find a video on my channel that will be displaying it. But until then, uh, I guess I even, I even camped out overnight and tried to wait like 24 hours to try to catch this thing and it still didn't show up. So yeah, 
I don't really know what else can be said about that. I don't think you can catch the, the channel catfish. And when you open up your compendium, I didn't do it in this video, but I did it when I wasn't recording. And it says that you actually have the fish there. It's like a 200 pound catfish. So I don't know if they were just messing with us here. I really don't know what to expect, but I'm hoping this video helps you guys out. Uh, thank you guys for watching the video. Once again, make sure you hit that like button if you if the video helped you guys out and you enjoyed it. Uh, this is going to be the ending of my Red Dead Redemption 2 Legendary Fishing Guide. I caught every single fish. So once again, if you guys want to click the links in the description, you're having trouble catching any of these fish. You can find videos to catch every single one with my best tips and tricks and insights and showing you all the locations of the legendary fish. Thank you guys once again for watching the video. It's your boy Matt Merced. Appreciate you guys coming back to the channel. Um, stay tuned. I will be having videos today. How to uh, hunt the legendary pronghorn and legendary cougar so stay tuned thank you guys for watching hit that subscribe button man and i'm out peace